Okay, shoulder dystocia uh, require additional maneuver to deliver the baby after failed genital traction. The risk fa factors are not preventable, divided into antepartum and intrapartum. During antepartum, the risk factors are history of ST, microsomic, CPD, maternal obesity. During intrapartum, the risk factors are apitocin augmentation, instrumental delivery, prolonged first stage, and second stage of labor. The risk of ST uh, to the doctor may have to go through litigation, to mother, perineal trauma, to fetus, uh, can cause cerebral palsy, brachial plexus injury, herbs palsy, or clavicular fracture. Management of SD uh, with the monomonic of helper, um, H E L P E R R, H call for help, especially speed, toughness, M O E, episiotomy, L. Leg in Mac Robert position. Okay, untuk besarkan ruang sacral, angkat kaki uh, mother sampai bahu. P. Super pubic pressure, depending on baby facing right or left. E. Enter rotational maneuver. R. Removal of posterior arm. Another R. Roll over mother on four legs. Okay, this is the video of how it looks like. Um, the mother will be put on McRobert position and episiotomy is done. Okay. Okay, the sign is a total sign whereby there is a retraction of the head. Uh, it is consistent with shoulder dystocia. Apply suprapubic pressure. Okay. And then uh, apply gentle traction to determine whether the shoulder is lodged or not under the bone. The attempt to realign and rotate the infant. Attempt to insert a hand and align the posterior shoulder to accomplish delivery. Deliver the posterior shoulder. And continue suprapubic pressure. The anterior shoulder pop under the surfaces and the baby is delivered.